Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows a large vesicle growth invading the right ureterovesical junction. You can see the right kidney and it shows moderate to severe hydronephrosis with hydroureter. An ultrasound scan is, uh, uh, is used to show if cancer is present and how large it is. An ultrasound cannot always find small tumors, so additional tests may be required. Ultrasound scans with full bladder is mandatory to see all the findings. You can see the hydronephrosis with hydroureter of the right side, right kidney. And it shows moderate to severe hydronephrosis with mild hydroureter. So one of the basic abdominal organs that is assessed during transabdominal ultrasound examination is the urinary bladder. The bladder must be filled with urine. This is a prerequisite for a reliable assessment and at the same time it is an accosting shadow in examining the adjacent structures and organs, for example prostate gland in males and female genital organs in females. Sonography enables detection of 95% of exophytic lesions within the urinary bladder with the diameter exceeding 5 mm. Mostly it is carcinoma of the urinary bladder. You can see the tracing of the right ureter and you can see there is no stone seen in the ureter in the upper and middle one third. Due to the malignant character of the vesicle mass and need for aggressive surgical treatment, a correct diagnosis of the disease is essential for patients as the lack of additional treatment and delayed treatment considerably affect prognosis. A bladder ultrasound can show how much urine the bladder holds when it is full and whether someone completely empties the bladder when urinating. Blood, bladder ultrasound is often done along with an ultrasound of the kidneys. Now you can see the urinary bladder and tracing of the ureter showed there's, there is no stone seen in the ureter and you can clearly see the right ureter is invaded by a large vesicle mass. So this mass is, this is the right ureter and this is the vesicle mass and this mass has caused the obstruction of the right ureter. So there is hydroureter and kidney also shows the moderate to severe hydronephrosis with hydroureter. You can see the mass is slightly rectangular in shape, is semi-solid to solid in consistency. And it has slightly heterogeneous ecogenicity. And this mass measures about more than 5 cm into less than 2 cm wide. This is the growth, basal growth. And now you will see the measurement of the, this mass. This mass measures about 4.6 cm and into 2.5 cm. So quite a large mass and this mass is attached to the right lateral wall of the 
یورنی بلیڈر اینڈ بیس آف دا یونی بلیڈر اینڈ دی ماس از انویڈنگ دی رائٹ یوریٹر سو دی یوریٹر شوز ہائیڈرو یوریٹر سو دس بزائکل گروس از انویڈنگ دی رائٹ یوریٹر اوپننگ ایٹ یوریٹر بزائکل جنکشن Bladder cancer develops when cells in the urinary bladder begins to grow abnormally rather than growing and divide in an orderly way. These cells develop mutations that cause them to grow out of control and not die. These abnormal cells from the tumor may cause chronic irritation of the lining of the urinary bladder. You can see significant blood flow is seen in the vesicle mass. Bladder cancers or bladder tumors are relatively common and most bladder tumors are cancerous. Bladder cancer sign and symptoms may include hematuria that is blood in the urine and it is painless in about 80 to 90 percent of the patients. 90 percent of the people with bladder cancer are older than 55 years of age and the average age people are diagnosed with bladder cancer is 73 you can find some important information in the description of this video thanks for watching please subscribe my channel and if you do like this video please click the like button thanks